Right. Good morning to everyone. Again to Wadi Desa. You can see beautiful sculptures made by nature thousands and thousands of years ago. Right. It's called Wadi Desa. And a beautiful natural destiny if you wish to spend our nights in a camping mood under the curvaces of rock you can see how the rocks are made of yeah. right you can uh, it's a roughly we can say around 150 kilometer from Tabuk 125 kilometer from Duba and uh, yeah, it's an end road to a small village. Okay. And actually, this area having the flow of fresh water, it uses a uh, uh, rising from the base of these rocks hills. And because of that water flow, you can see all this marshy vegetation. Yeah, it's good. It's good. Anyway, I do remember I came to here two years back, and it was on a summer season, and recorded the scenery. Now it is in winter season. Yeah, you can see the now how the nature developed. You can see some of the four-wheel pickup cars that you uh, hire them for a vehicle driving, and anyway, we used to choose our own walking. There are rental highs, okay, but these are beautiful rocks. Anyway, on the way we'll see now there what's going on. Now this Saudi man asking for, would you like to have a car rental? Yeah, and my friend is making a deal, but we already plan not to have to have the car. So. You can hear their conversation. Hi. Yeah. yeah. Here have paid rented houses. If you want to hire a house, they will take you throughout anyway. These are the wild dead palms growing profusely in this marshy land. Yeah, it's a my nice and shining friend. A baby, tal, tal. It's a native Tony Acacia. Bah. 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 Anyway, he is just afraid of. Or scared of. Yeah, I can see. But I like this uh, black uh, Fortuner. I should. Oh, somebody from Neom. A baby. Somebody from Neom. Yeah, somebody from Neom. Right, it's a time to see how the 
water flow and anyway, I think now the season is different So like a river you can see but I think it have to change a lot uh, I'm sure when I visited previously it was in a different style I think after that had a heavy rain they taken all thing before the flow direction was entirely different here was a small pond like a structure anyway now it's very clear this back taken out by the Heavy water flow. Yeah, right. It's a native acacia tree. How are you fe feeling the climate? It's cool now. Cool, yeah, because that uh, I like to go and get my coat. <laughs> I, I also feeling so. <laughs> anyway. You can see a teratophyte group Adiandum here. And so yeah, it had changed a lot from my previous visit, and uh, and. Uh, I think the heavy water flow changed the excess structure. Deviated the water flow. And they are different.
So you can see how strong this water flow. You can see the water coming from different sources, one from this line and from the other line. I think this is the base of this Wadi Disa. Yes, it's very beautiful. Yeah, if you want to drive, you should have a four-wheel drive. Otherwise, four-wheel drive with SUV with uh, good uh, ground clearance. See how they are driving on. Oh, it's a long area again. They have another track. Okay. Okay. Yeah, very beautiful. Very beautiful. I think very recently was heavy, heavy rain. Uh, you can see wet, uh, sandy area. Like a river bed. Yeah, it's good. It's good. It's good. Yeah, this is how the water flow from here. This one line, another line coming from there. Both joining. I don't know from there where it's going on. Anyway. You can see wild uh, olive trees, olive, not olive trees here, medium plants, it's flowering shrubs anyway, sorry, not tree. You can see the native dead palms, okay, I'm sure this wadi I have some relation with uh, most spirit and most lies, because this area is very close related with this area where Moses and his descendants live, yeah. And pretty beautiful area. Pretty beautiful area. Pretty beautiful area. Yeah. Why did it? Yeah. Right.
Yeah, let's walk around and see. Oh, it's a group of people who lives here. It's uh, amazing. Yeah, it's a community here. Right. Well, uh, anyway, let's move forward. It's not easy to walk on a sandy bar because it's puffy. I'm taking much energy from my body. Right. It's good to keep, take out some calorie deposited as a fat on my muscles and free um, the strain on my liver. Yep. Good, good. Right, anyway, during my first trip, uh, I didn't come to this land. Only ended in the first part of this floor. I got the stand now. Yeah, but my friend Mr. Shackley, who is in my manager of my company where I work now. Yeah, I don't know this common what it means for, but it's nice to see. Along with the net to your palms, only here, and then a beautiful appearance. Yeah, I think now I am heading to the foot of the hill where it starts the floor. Let's see. Let's meet it. And what a beautiful different plants are here. Let's see if we said. Does we have any idea? No idea. It's a different plant for me. Uh, yeah, a bit different plant for me. No idea who are they. Anyway, this I know, but not know the names. It's good. It's good. My dear friends, it's quite amazing to see. And uh, if you have a chance to come and visit any of these areas in Tabokor Duba or Bada or Hakel of Tabok province of Saudi Arabia. You shouldn't miss these areas to come and see. Yeah. Right, I know this video is too long for you but it's a great experience for you. I still am unable to stop it, not all for you. Still continuing to record it. I think it's long, long and long. Long, long and long and long. Still I am unable to precise the area where from the water bubbling out. So this I think is a, where the sheep heard walking up and down. At least I can walk over here. Nice foot of the hill. Very beautiful and pretty. I'm sure you'll like it. It will be amazing to have these areas in the land where it should be served as a desert. Right. Okay. So, I should end up my video. To give some rest for my hand but it's not well to stop because of the continuing beauty of this area see how they are how they are how they are you know. uh, it's a long and long and long I will show you a local plant with a beautiful fruit pot. I think it's not edible but looking beautiful to see. I believe you might have seen from my previous videos. And also this plant. Yeah. Right. This plant I think belongs to Osimum group, yeah, and it's a flavorous, yeah, in our country we have it's the same group, 
same variety but it, i mean different variety of the same group yeah i have to end up this recording right it's an amazing experience what it is uh what it is uh Uh-huh. <laughs>